Ever noticed how animals on faraway islands look kind of strange? Like the giant tortoises in the Galapagos, or the Komodo dragon that looks like a mini dinosaur. What makes them so different? When a little piece of land becomes an island, animals that get stuck there must survive on their own. No outsiders, no new competition. Over a long time, they change to fit that special place, sometimes becoming totally unique. It's because of evolutionary isolation. When animals live alone on islands, no predators, no new species, they start to evolve in weird and creative ways. It's nature doing freestyle evolution. On islands, small animals can grow huge because they don't need to hide anymore. Big animals, on the other hand, can shrink because food is limited. That's why nature makes giant rats and tiny elephants. Galapagos tortoise, so big it's like a moving rock. Komodo dragon, a top predator that looks ancient. Flora's giant rat, supersized and fearless. Mini cypress elephant, small, smart and adorable. These creatures prove that isolation can make evolution go wild. Islands stay peaceful for millions of years. No big changes, no ice ages. That gives animals plenty of time to slowly evolve into new, amazing forms. Think of an island as nature's secret lab, a place where evolution can experiment, remix, and create strange but wonderful life. No rules, no limits, just pure creativity. That's why island animals are so weird and so awesome.